What is going on, everybody? Hello, hello. Welcome back to the channel, After Sound here, bringing you Splinter Lens content every single day. We also stream right here on this channel every Tuesday, Thursday, and Sunday morning, so come by and say hello. All right, as you can see, I am not in my usual setup, still traveling post Splinter Fest, so I apologize for the lack of content, but trying to get to it now, trying to get caught up on everything, and I do have a couple of days here while I'm visiting some family and friends in Chicago, so hoping to dive into that. But first thing that I wanted to share with you, at least for this video specifically, is the end of season rewards. So I got... Uh, Actually, I forgot how many I got. I think it's like 30-something diamond level chests. Now, I wasn't playing as much as I could have, obviously due to Splinterfest and travel over the past week, but uh, 37 still seemed pretty good, so I thought I would share it here with you guys and see what we could come up with. So, uh, was it 37? Maybe 39? Probably 39. We'll see. All right, so let's just go through. I'm still collecting a lot of these cards. Ooh, gold foil, I will take that. I still need some Naga Assassins to level up my old rewards cards. Got a bunch of potions here. Ooh, nice, two gold foils, very cool. Uh, commons, but uh, you know, I'll take it. 17 SPS, 14 SPS, so that is not terrible. And we'll go through afterwards and, oh nice, another Tide Biter. My first merits as well. Uh, let's see. I'm curious to know, though. Well, we'll get to it in a second. Ooh, 33 SPS. Okay, so we're we're starting to stack up some of this SPS here. It's not going to be crazy amounts, but uh, I will take it. We do have a pack as well. Got some more merits. Got some more SPS. Some common cards. And SPS overall. So, not terrible. I do want to see what the rewards for this look like. And, um... Should we go to Splinter Share? We can go to Splinter Share. Splintershare.info. And let's just put in After Sound. And we can see what we got for end of season rewards. So we got a pack and some SPS. So $8.82. I mean, it's not terrible. Uh, it's not amazing, but it's not terrible either. Again, this was about 39 chests, I believe. There you go. Yeah, 39 chests. So I'm curious to know. This was one of the more difficult, um, one of the more difficult seasons. And I know this next season is probably going to be just as tough. But I want to know how did you guys do? What were your thoughts on this overall? Now, um, I'm trying to see what cards I can give out that be worth anything. We'll we'll do at least one giveaway on on this so because i'm already good on my gargoyle lines i'm already maxed out uh we'll do a giveaway here so i'll pull a winner all you got to do is leave your ign and let me know uh i don't know what's the best thing that you won in this most se uh, most recent end of season rewards so go ahead throw your ign and uh that in there if you want to go ahead and win this gargoyle line otherwise uh i will catch you all in the next video and i'll see you around the game Take care.